wood products that we stock are generally things like uh, wall coverings, uh, this paneling, this is a shiplap, um, we also sell tongue and groove paneling, uh, we do have a line of hardwood flooring, um, kind of a rustic, more of a cottage cabin grade uh, flooring. Um, plywood, not yet. Uh, those lumber markets have been extremely volatile. Um, another thing we specialize in that most companies don't is cedar products. Um, I have northern white cedar from the Great Lakes region. I have eastern red cedar from the, uh, the Kentucky, Tennessee area, and then I have western red cedar coming out of Idaho and Montana. Um, so those cedar products are generally very hard to find. We are pretty much half price from what anybody else in the region is on our cedar. Um, right now we're running northern white cedar fence pickets, one by six, six foot for three dollars a piece. You cannot find them for that price anywhere. I, I, I'm probably the cheapest. So frequently, um, you might come here thinking you're going to build your garage, and I'm going to say, I'm sorry, I've only got you know 25 or 30 percent of the components for your garage. And the customer says, well, well why don't you have everything? I said, because I can't give you a deal on it. And if I can't give you a deal, that means I wasn't happy enough to buy it. I couldn't have a good margin on it. So I'm not going to play that game. Um, I think that fits pretty well. That, that business concept fits well with our community, with the Northwoods. Um, there are a lot of people looking for a deal on something. There are people that want to build the dog house, the deer stand, the chicken coop, work on their barn, and they don't want to buy uh, overpriced lumber. So they're looking for it. Interesting. There's a lot of um, smaller shops, and I was a small shop once, and those small shops, um, they struggle because they're they're trying to offer their customers a product at a reasonable price, and then they, they have the ability to go to a big box store or another lumber company and buy, but that's at retail. But they don't buy enough volume to deal with a big sawmill. Uh, and the big sawmills don't want to talk to you unless you're buying full semi-loads. Um, there's you know, bank paperwork has to be all straight, credit agreements, background checks. You know, places that supply the world, they don't want little guys. So for that in-between guy, that guy with a small shop where he's just getting going, we're probably worth a call because I don't have to sell it to you at full retail price. I can cut you a deal and I'm already dealing with all the major players in the industry. Um, I buy from some of the same mill groups that supply the world. I mean, Menard, Lowe's, Home Depot. I've got wood in there that should be on the, the shelf at Lowe's. Uh, so, you know, I've probably got that option for that small to mid-sized guy that, you know, he doesn't want to buy at the big box, but he can't buy it at the big mill or MPD. Um, that's pretty much every product in my building is a product that when you load it and leave in your car, I want you to look at whoever came with you and say, man, we, we got a good deal. Um, and that if I can't find that deal on the open market, I won't buy it and I won't stop. I would recommend any brand new business definitely talk to their local economic development office. But Angie at Economic Development has been nothing but knowledge. I mean, the, there's so much experience in that office, um, so many programs available, just general guidance, which way to steer you. Um, she's been very helpful. We use the Main Street Bounce Back to um, put fresh paint on the building inside and out. Um, we put a new water supply line in from the street to feed our bathroom area. Um, I am actually looking at some roof improvements here. There are a few leaks on the roof. Um, so I think uh, maybe when it cools down a little bit this fall, uh, we're gonna take a little bit of that, of that money and, and fix up our roof and I'd like to grow uh, you know, we're only six weeks into the game right now, it's, we're really new, um, but I think with my connections and my ability to buy lumber, um, my price is always going to be right, and uh, I think we can grow this location. Uh, we have uh, two and a half acres here, uh, even though we're only we're inside a 9,000 square foot building, we have room for another 9,000 square foot building on site if need be enough right now. Uh, thank you to the public for you know helping us get going. Uh, the customers are coming. Um, we you know we're going to be here. Uh, we're not going anywhere. Um, we're open Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and Saturday from 8 a.m. to noon.